Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we will be going over some of my Amazon favorites, fitness edition. I do have an old Amazon video that I posted, I don't know, like five, six months ago. I will put a link in one of these corners. I think it's this corner, but I never really know. But I'm gonna go with this corner. I think it's like my 2020 favorites, something like that. I honestly can't remember. But for today's video, it is going to be my Amazon favorites, fitness gear stuff clothing pre-workout gym stuff you know oh before i forget i do have an amazon storefront i'll include that link below and pretty much you can just go in there and i have different categories of all of my favorite things and so that way you can find all of my amazon favorites all at once but of course everything will be linked down in the description box below my first item that i really really like is of course pre-workout so you can get this at like vitamin shop gnc whatever but i order mine off amazon mainly because it's two-day free shipping but it's prolific by pe science i also use high volume but i'm out of that so i don't have the container but prolific has caffeine in it but it doesn't give you the jitters i hate getting like the tingly feeling the itchy feeling i hate that it like makes me panic so this is perfect for me because it doesn't make you panic it just gives you nice clean energy and then high volume doesn't have caffeine in it that is the one that i'll take if i'm working out like past five o'clock or something i'll just take high volume because it still gives you a burst of energy but this has caffeine so i don't like taking this too late in the evening or else i won't sleep but if i am working out in the morning or the beginning of the day i'll actually stack prolific in high volume so i'll take one and a half or two scoops of this and one and a half or two scoops of high volume with it because high volume gives you that really good pump and especially on a leg day we love a good booty pump am i right or am i right i'm right okay so that's that next what are you gonna take your pre-workout in a shaker bottle so i actually just ordered this my shaker ball is still in the bag but i own plenty of bottles by this brand blender bottle but i just love how this is white i think it looks so clean and so aesthetic and you know me i love neutrals so this is great because i actually have like a light blue and a dark blue but i think that i like the fact that this is white and just kind of clean you know if you guys don't know what this is basically you can put your protein or your pre-workout or your bcaa's in here with water and you shake it up and that ball inside there will break up all the crumbles if your pre-workout or protein is powdery this will break it all up and make it a nice smooth liquid and then you just drink it next barbell pad i've mentioned this in a video before i cannot go to the gym on a leg day without this because sometimes my gym has one other times i can't find it other times i don't know who's been using it so i'd rather just bring my own and basically you just put this on the barbell as you're doing hip thrusts and you don't hurt your vagine if i do hip thrusts without one of these you're gonna break your little girl in half and we don't want that okay we do not want that get a barbell pad bring your own it comes in plenty of colors and this has lasted me quite a while already and they're not that expensive next okay this i'm like the most excited for it's this gym bag but hear me out i used to go to 24 hour fitness and i changed over to crunch but at both gyms they started doing no gym bags in the common workout space so basically like the squat rack free weights literally anywhere you can't have your bag it has to be in the locker room unless it's a drawstring bag if it's a drawstring bag you can have it with you i hate drawstring bags like the super cheap looking ones that you get for free from like tropical smoothie when you go on flip-flop day or something like that so i found this one it's not very expensive and i've been using it for several months and it is still in great condition it's nice and big first of all this is opened it has adjustable straps the straps are nice and thick sorry i'm on my really annoying office chair and this is what it sounds like so sorry about that and then it also has like a little loop here if you need to attach anything to the outside of your bag it has a front pocket which is actually nice and big and spacious that is where i throw my mask and my keys when i am oh my god can you guys chill and then my favorite part if you follow me on instagram you guys know i have been really into jump roping lately 
So it has this little side pocket right here. And I hold my jump rope in there. And it's like a big pocket. Obviously, it goes into the middle section, but it's a huge pocket. So I keep my jump rope in there. And then the bag itself is like just really big and really spacious. So yeah, love my gym bag. Inside my gym bag is also something I want to talk about. Wrist straps. I've talked about these on my channel before, but if you're trying to deadlift, you need these because you put them on like this. And then you wrap it around the bar and then you hold it. So that way your grip is a lot better because you're gripping a material instead of the bar. So your hands don't slip. And this takes the pressure off your hands and kind of puts it more on your wrist. So that way you can control your weight. And I, oh my God, you guys are just gonna have to forgive the way I look today because it's been a stressful week. Yeah, sorry if I look deranged. Anyway wrist straps you need them if you are deadlifting or doing bulgarian split squats or holding heavy dumbbells for some reason or barbell again i've talked about this before but you need this it is an ankle strap you put your ankle in it you wrap it around your ankle like this and then you connect the cable to it and you do your kickback sidekicks, whatever you want. It came in a pack of two, love them. All right, next we're gonna go over some clothing items because you know, your girl loves her clothes. So the first items I'm gonna talk about is tops. First, we are going to talk about this sports bra. So it is in the color like baby pink and I think it's so cute, like look at that color. Aww. The top is really nice because it's just very simple. And honestly, I saw people talking about the sports bra and I was kind of like, that's so basic. Why, like, why is it so hyped right now? And then I bought it and now I'm obsessed. It has like this two inch band around the bottom. So it gives you really good support. And then the straps are nice and comfortable. They're not digging in anywhere on the sides. I feel super held in. And then in the back, we have a nice crisscross detail, but it's not too strappy because I don't love sports bras that are super, super strappy. I would say that this gives me a good like high support, medium to high, but really on the like on the high side it's definitely one of the most supportive sports bras that i own also there is cup pads it does come with cup pads and the cup pads are removable if you want to take them out love 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 you need this trust me just buy it just try it if you have amazon prime it's free returns if you hate it return it but i'm telling you you're gonna love it next is going to be this camo fitness crop top tank top thing it is like a navy blue color but like a dusty navy blue the girl is very brushed like that buttery soft brushed feel you need this the back looks just like the front it's super simple there is a built-in sports bra and it does come with padding and you can remove the pads and i really like the length of it because with high-waisted pants it comes like pretty much flush with a high-waisted pant so you don't really see too much tummy but it doesn't overlap the legging so i really like the length of this so like i said this tank top is super brushed and soft this is what the material looks like so if you have pets hair will stick to this i am going to be totally honest with you this one is another go-to for me it's literally the same tank top like same length same cut, same stitching, same everything, except it is by Dragon Fit, and their brand makes these with more of a spandexy, athletic type of material. Like literally, no hair sticks to this. It's it's like that spandexy material. You know what I'm talking about, where that sleek performance material. If you do have pets like me, I have two massive dogs, so this is kind of more of my go-to, just because it doesn't get lint on it. But I love and I'm obsessed with the color by Camo Fitness. So I do like those too. I just have to carry my lint roller with me. That's all, no big deal. Next, let's talk about pants. These, I'm actually gonna order them in a different size. That's why the tag, or a different color. That's why the tag is still on them. But I really love this. This is also by Camo Fitness. If you haven't heard of Camo Fitness, by the way, they are one of my top favorite, like legging top sports bra activewear basically these are like brand new to their website and now they're on amazon so the waist is slightly tapered in which we like because it gives us curves are we joking there's no front seam which means no camel toe for a fraction of the price of like alpha Lee or balance athletica all these brands that are coming out with no front seam but they cost a hundred dollars per legging i think this is like 32 dollars 
I love them. I just love them. And the length is decent. It's like a 7 eighths to full length. They're like more so on the full length. Length. And then in the back, what I love about these is the seam tapers down so it does give you a little bit of booty contour. It doesn't cut off your butt cheeks. It gives you a nice round area for your butt cheeks to sit. I think it makes the booty look great. And there is a butt seam so you can hike it up your cheeks if you want to without getting a camel toe. Lastly, I'm going to talk about these joggers I just came up on. These things are the most stretchy, most comfortable jogger I've ever Okay, they're not like the fleece cotton blend joggers. This is going to be an athletic jogger. It does have a nice scrunched waistband and then drawstrings that do work. It does tighten the waist and the pocket detail is really nice. It even has like a hidden zipper basically. It has a nice seam layover that covers the zipper, which I think looks high quality. The white is a bit see-through so you can see the pockets when you're wearing them. But I mean, like, I don't really care. It is a great length. If you are my height and I'm 5'9", if you're around my height, these are for you because I know it's so hard to find joggers that look good on tall people. These are an option for you. And they are so stretchy. Like, so, so stretchy. And I just love them. So I'm also going to order these in a different color because white is great, but we know I'm going to stain the heck out of those. So I need a backup pair. Do you ever feel like you're just talking too much and you're just so parched? That's me. That's me right this second. I feel much better now. So that pretty much wraps up the video. I hope that you found some things in this video that you can use and that you also come to love. So do me a favor, head over to my Instagram. I have a link in the description below or you can just look me up. My tag name is Tan Han, T-A-N underscore H-A-N. Then if you order some of these items, tag me in your story, post about it in your story, and then tag. I'll repost you. I would love to see that you guys are enjoying the recommendations that I have for you. So yeah, um, I guess that's it. All right, well, I guess I will talk to you guys next Monday at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. See ya.